I was the lawyer for the cruise line DJ who was fired for yelling, let's get down like the Titanic when the beat dropped. And I mean, how was he to know that the great grandson of a Titanic passenger would be on the boat that day? But honestly, maybe the cruise line is right. Maybe the DJ shouldn't be spouting stuff like that when you're traipsing around in a boat around the Atlantic Ocean. The legal trouble for my client came because he got fired on the first day of the cruise, which means they had six more days before they would port again and be able to kick him off the ship. My client turned that thing into a six day bender. I mean, he's going down the zip line at full speed cannonball falling into a jacuzzi full of 70 year old women. I mean, my client's guilty of absolutely everything they're charging him with. And a lot of people ask me, why as a defense attorney do you even take on clients like this? And the truth is I have to take clients like this because I haven't won a case in a while. In fact, I've lost my last 15 cases. And so when I get a case and can make any money, I take it. The problem is it's a vicious cycle. I take these terrible cases and I lose them, which means I don't get any better cases. I get even worse cases. And people are like, oh, no lawyer will take me. Maybe that guy will. And I will because I need to pay the bills. So I did my absolute best, but that DJ 